PMS Seltzer here with UFRAG TV and I am at the G Expo in Philly and here is Jeff Beckett from Shocker Toys. How you doing? How's it going? It's going pretty well. What do you got going on here? Uh, at this show we have um, some uh, comic book toys. We have uh, our new designer figures called Malos. Right, and these can be customized completely? Do these come blank? Yeah, they do. Uh, I'll actually open one up to show you. Got a special treat here. Wow, and what can you do on here? Do you need a special kit to paint these? Nope, uh, you can use any kind of um, uh, enamels or uh, any kind of uh, acrylic paints work on them. Testers, okay. stuff like that. And were these your first toys? I know you started, you founded uh, Shocker Toys. That's yeah? right. Uh, we did a, a, a block figure called the Shakini, uh, which actually we're redesigning now. So the Malos were like our bigger version. Uh, basically, it's an articulated action figure that you can take apart and you can paint and design it yourself. So you can make whatever you want out of it. That's really cool. And I know you got some, some really uh, serious brands here. You've got uh, yeah. Metalocalypse. Yeah, uh, we got Death Clock. Uh, I'll show you here. here <laughs> Let me get this back in the box. Let's see there. if she can do it. Ah, yes, there's, uh, there's most of our products there. That's the Indie Spotlight. That's Scud. He was a Sega game. If uh, any of the gamers here remember, that's uh, Scud, Disposable Assassin. That's the evil version, Soul, who was hired to kill him and then hired to kill himself. Uh, Ninja Assassins. That's Dick Tracy, of course. Everybody knows uh, Chester Gould version of Dick Tracy. That's part of our Indie Spotlight series. That's uh, Shadowhawk variant, and that's uh, Kabuki from David Mack, all part of our Indie Spotlight comic book heroes line, which is the third biggest comic book action figure line under Marvel Legends of DC Universe. So it's a bunch of independent comics, uh, pulp comics. We have the Phantom, stuff like that. There's the Max's uh, foot going up there. There's his claw. Right, you got a lot this of rare piece. stuff, a lot of different yeah. wide variety. Do you have a favorite? Uh, MTV is the max, of course, is my favorite. I had to have that license, uh, so it worked out nice. You got the ISs and everything, and uh, I think it came out really good. It's a good balance of an articulated action figure uh, and a good sculpt. You know, it's um, it's got good flexibility. It's very poseable. It's it's not top heavy. We, we use a different plastic on top. So there's our Malos, our, our blank figures. Oh, they're so cute. Design them yourself. Any kind of paints work on them. Uh, they, right now, they come in black or white. Uh, they don't come with stickers, but they will be soon. So these are our prototype models that we're selling. So That's great. We're selling. And uh, how do you like our fans here at VG Expo? Are they are they doing you doing your proper? Are they yeah, coming yeah. over? Yeah, everybody's awesome. Stopping over, taking a look at everything. You know. So uh, I think we're busier tomorrow. So that's well, a little well. shot of everything. Shot of our banner. All right. Thanks so much for coming yeah. to talk to us. No we're problem. really excited. Yeah. They yeah. When they buy the Max. Okay, this is the Max here. Whoop, tilted angle it there. So this is uh we have the Max action figure. You basically get uh, three ises with the line. You get an extra head, so you can take the uh, the headdress off, uh, which was his outback look, and then you have his regular look, which is uh, just you know when he's in the real world where it's, he has no headdress. And uh, also, if you collect the whole series, all seven figures, and mail away the UPCs, you get a free Mister Gone figure as the mail away. Good to yep. know. Yep, and then we have Death Clock, our Death Clock set uh, from Adult Swim, Metalocalypse, Death Clock. You basically get all the uh, all the characters, all five. That's them with Nathan Explosion and everybody. Yep. Okay. Which one has been your most popular? Uh, which character? It's a set. Which yeah, it's a oh set. no, no, which which of all your toys? I know you got a uh, ton of licenses. We pretty much uh, everything sells well. Uh, what we what we choose is stuff that we like and stuff that the fans like. So we make toys that the fans like. Instead of the other way around, just going for something and, hey, we're going to spend money on this license and just grab whatever we can. We don't do that. We try to find the best stuff that we can find. You know what I mean? So. Alrighty. Well, thanks so much yeah. for coming out to talk to us. No problem. Thank you.